Hi, my name is James with Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. Even if you don't think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, every restaurant owner should follow these simple steps. If you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, I'm guessing you probably have asked yourself, what are their favorite foods? Well, the answer is simple. It's anything. And you can cut off everything you think seems delicious, and they're gonna go to something that you would never have thought. Chew a hole through a jug of oil, eat your flour, eat a sweet and low packet. It doesn't matter to them. So you've gotta secure your food. Dry storage anywhere in the restaurant, right to the sugar caddies on the table. Keep it clean and protect your food to protect your restaurant. Water. It's a critical source for rats and all living things. There's plenty of places to get water in a restaurant. Whether you left some water behind after cleaning the floors, or there's water in your drains. Often, the large open floor drains create a problem because they never seem to dry out. If you throw ice in the sink, they'll drip all night. So you've got to keep not only the sink dry, but the drains below. And you can do that easily by covering it with a grate you can get from your purveyor or even putting a brick over the top of it. It may sound silly, but remember, you've got a rodent problem and they need water. Snap traps, they're the best way to go when you're dealing with a rodent problem in your restaurant. They're easy to use and they're humane. When you're setting rat traps, make sure you follow a couple steps. You use very little bait in them. You don't wanna to put too much because then you're just feeding them. You wanna create charts, one for the back of the house and maybe use a seating chart for the front of the house. That way every morning somebody has something to look at to retrieve them all before patrons or purveyors come in the building. Avoid using poison at all cost. It will only create other problems for you. If you have a rat problem in your restaurant, you probably have holes that they've created throughout your baseboards and drywall. Whatever you do, leave those holes until all the rodents are gone, your place is sealed up and the problem is solved. Then if you wanna go back and patch those holes for appearances, go ahead. But if you do that, while the problem is still going on, they're gonna chew more holes in your drywall and in your baseboards and create more issues for you. So use those holes, put traps in front of them, but don't close them up because they're gonna chew their way back out. Do you have rats in your restaurant? Did one of your patrons see them? If you know that patron, talk to them directly and ask them kindly just to keep it to themselves and let them know that you're working on it. Don't keep apologizing. Don't follow them out the door. A quick, we're very sorry. We're working on this diligently. We'll do. After that, you better hit the ground running. Either you get trapped set and get your building sealed up like a drum or call somebody who can do it. It's going to spread quick. So take care of it quick. If you have or think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, give us a call here at Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. We will discreetly help you as quickly and professionally as we can.